It has been three years since the annual Montana State Spring Rodeo has kicked up dust inside the Brook Breeden, but on Thursday it made its triumphant return with a near sold out crowd on hand for the first night of performance rounds. And with the Bronx saddled up, the freshman from MSU Northern Garrett Cunningham was the only cowboy to stick out the full eight seconds, sitting uncontested on the leaderboard with a score of 72. In steer wrestling, Montana Western's TJ Sigmund was quick out the shoot, clocking a 4.2, moving his teammate Bryce Harrison down to second, who wrestled a 5.6. Over to the ladies, there was only one cowgirl that cracked six seconds in goat tying, and that was Montana State's Haley Garrison with a crowd-pleasing 6.8 during her spot in Friday's finals. And as the saying goes, save the best for last, which was the case in team roping with Northwest College duo Spencer Gordon, Silas York. Their seven and a half seconds crushed the previous leaders who clocked a 9-3. Now with the saddles off, how about some bareback bronc riding? That's Montana State's Nathaniel Deerhammer with a score of 73 points for the top ride of the night. Isabella Fossum earned more points for the Bobcats in breakaway roping, clocking a 2.8. And then tie down roping Miles City College with their first win of the night thanks to Cole Texler's time of 10-4. And it goes without saying why the Montana State women's rodeo team are the reigning national champions with another record time of 15 seconds flat in the barrels by Molly Mae Salmont. No scores were recorded in the bull riding event, but there is one highlight worth showing. Yep, that's Bobcat Athletic Director Leon Costello getting ready to pay his dues after losing a bet to the rodeo team. And out the shoot he goes. He might have not beat the clock, but not a bad ride for an athletic director. Day two action picks back up Friday morning with slack at 10 a.m. Performance rounds will conclude the day at 7. In Bozeman, Ashley Washburn, MTN Sports.